I had a going back one topic. I had a question about the um, container registry stuff. What yeah. I would absolutely love is to just so on my local machine, I can tell Docker to use a pull through cache. Mm -hmm. I can tell Docker anytime you see registry.docker.io or whatever, yeah, yeah, I want yeah. you to go here instead. Yeah. Can you do that to Kubernetes? Um, well, yes and no. Uh, well, two things. So one is you need to have that pull through cache available before Kubernetes launches. So in, in another account with connectivity. No problem. I run JFrog container registry and it works perfectly. Cool. Yeah, no. So I, what I was going to say is like, I, what I thought you were going to say is I was hoping Amazon was just going to come out with a pull through cache registry. Uh, and uh, that would have been pretty sweet, but that's not the answer. Well, the problem is all the Helm charts and stuff still say Docker, you know, yeah. Docker hub. Yeah. So, and so I want Kubernetes to just anytime it sees Docker Hub, it just makes that substitution and points at my pull through cache instead. Yeah. So two things. I mean, if you're still using the actual Docker daemon uh, with uh, Kubernetes, you can uh, modify the, the arguments passed to the Docker daemon uh, at start. Uh, the other idea is one of those mutating admission controllers, which would mm. automatically look at the images um, of your pods, rewrite them in such a way that whatever pull through cache you have would know how to fetch right. the origin of those. But I, yeah, it would take some further expl exploration. Any other ideas? Did you use operators in that? Like if you had a plugin that you know always looked for your pods and then you gave it those variables and then it rewrote it. So like Andy, you would load up those Helm charts, do the translation or tell the program what the translation would be. And then that operator you know, could go out or is that too Yeah, I would, use a, I would use a mutating admission controller for that, which is based, which is an operator. It, yeah. It's, you know, it's this, one that kind of comes built into Kubernetes. Yeah. Um, and you're, you're totally right, Eric, uh, that's the perfect answer. I just hadn't thought about it. A mutating admission control. I like that better than messing with Docker config on the node level. Yeah. Because um, I can use, this could be a great excuse to mess around with OPA. It, yeah, exactly. And, th and then you can have a policy that you don't allow from uh, any other place than your pull through cache. So I'll share that link as well. Oh, and Jim says, you can always hijack the DNS. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> become your own CA uh, for docker.com.